How we doing, YouTube? This is Manny Jones. Back at you at NASCAR Thunder 2004 with more of the carrier in our career mode. Last few races, we struggled a lot at uh, Pocono. Kept spinning out in turn two. And we managed to have a good finish at Michigan with a 23rd place start and a 23rd place finish. So we head now to the one of two road courses scheduled to, uh, to Infinity on for the Dodge Save Mart 350. Uh, we hopefully we should have a good time here. I can put down a good qualifying lap no matter what equipment so let's hope for something good out of the points Stewart has a 185 point lead over Dale Jr. Stewart with six wins Jr. with none this so far this season find them Dale Jarrett Kevin Harvick Mark Martin Ryan Newman Jeff Burton Matt Kenseth Bobby Labonte Sterling Marlin Jimmy Johnson how about Jeff Gord moving up in the points out of 12 13th is Ricky Rudd 14th Rusty Wallace 15th is Kurt Busch Mikey Waltrip behind him followed by Bill Elliott Jamie McMurray leader of the rookie of the year race Donnie Benson Jeff Green Ricky Craven Elliott Sadler Terry Labonte Ward Burton Jeremy Mayfield Kenny Wallace Jerry Nadeau Steve Park we are in 29th place second in rookie of the year Brett Bodine, 30th. 31st is Robbie Gordon. 32nd is Kyle Petty. Behind them is Jack Sprague, third and rookie of the year. Joe Nemechek, Ken Schrader, Hermie Sadler, Greg Biffle, Casey Mears, Christian Fittipaldi, Kevin LePage, Mike Skinner, Stanton Barrett, Chase Montgomery, Ashton Lewis, David Green, and the 22... Oh, I'm sorry. I mean the 26 of Kevin Grubb. Not sure why that glitch is a thing. Did they forget to record the spotter lines? I, I don't know. Lap champion right now is Tony Stewart. He's led the most laps by far, more than anyone this season. Your manufacturer championship right now at Chevrolet, followed by Ford, Dodge, and Pontiac. Pole award is on to Jeff Gordon for the most part. Tony Stewart with four, Mark Martin with two. Harvick, Johnson, Wallace, uh, uh, and us with one pole apiece. Rookie of the year again, Jamie McMurray leads. He's 18th in points. World 29th. Not sure if we'll be able to get too close to him, but we can hope. Behind them is Justice Jack Spray, Greg Biffle, Casey Mears, and Christian Fittipaldi, followed by Stanton Barrett, Chase Montgomery, and Ashton Lewis, and David Green and Kevin Grubb. So let's hope we've been good here at Sonoma. A good qualifying time will definitely help us out in getting uh, a good bonus from Craftsman, who again is still on the car. Let's try and uh, fulfill those requirements and keep uh, Sears Craftsman on the vehicle. Up to Daytona, man. Let's get to it. All right, qualifying here in the Sonoma Valley. Let's hope for something pretty darn good here, man. I would love that. I would really, really do enjoy that. It's a good corner, though, here. It's a really good corner. I'm liking that. We just got to stay consistent with our corners. I did some digging before I record this video, and I found out that uh, I don't think Kerry Earnhardt has raced at a road course ever. I looked through his two full seasons in NASCAR, the one he had in 02 with uh, Fitz Bradshaw racing, and in 2000, and I want to say it was five or six with, oh God, with uh, Thor Sport. Yeah, he's one of Thor Sport's right racing's uh, first drivers in the truck series. I couldn't find a road course, so I don't think Kerry Earnhardt actually raced at a road course. I could be wrong, though. All right, good. Accelerate. Good. We should put something good down here. Didn't want to hit the wall. Let's see what we put down here, though. Come on. Something good. Ooh, B1! Let's keep it going. That's what I'm talking about. Come on now, Kerry. There we go, there we go. Come on now, Carrie. He won. This be our second pole award of the season. We had the one at the Richmond race, and well, we all know how that went down. Oh, shit, no. It's okay, we already put on a time. Well, we're fine. Oh, no, 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 no. Back it up. Back it up. Thank you. So nothing to worry about. When we put that when we put that first lap down, that'll be our time, so let's just bring it across the line. 
and lose control of the car again. I might have to put on limited driver assist because holy hell, we are really losing control of the car now. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, hold on to it please, thank you! Please don't damage it too much. There we go, there we go, there we go, nope! Oh god. We got a little too loose. Oh god. Well, at least with the car on the pole. <laughs> pole position for Kerry Earnhardt. Despite the mishaps on the second qualifying lap. Wow, we lap P1. On That's right. Give us that bonus money, baby. NASCAR Winston Cup Racing in the Sonoma Valley today. EA Sports is live with flag-to-flag -flag coverage of today's Dodge Save Mart 350 from the Infineon Raceway. This course should present quite a challenge to these drivers, wouldn't you agree? Finding a safe place to pass here is tough to say the least. Look for a lot of action in the final turn, a tight hairpin where drivers will be trying to outbreak each other all race long. The Sears Craftsman car really stepped up in qualifying this week. You're right, and what a relief this must be. That team has been working hard all year, but it seems they can never catch a break in qualifying. This time, they're starting up front. Dale Jarrett has an impressive average finish this year. If you finish in the top 10 every week, then the championship becomes an attainable goal. This team wants to get the big money at the end of the year, so they are going to be working even harder to keep up this string of top finishes. How about the consistency shown by Mark Martin? Points, points, points. Wins are great when they come, but top 10 finishes week after week are what build your points. Heck, you could win the championship on top 10s alone if you're consistent. Command has been given. We will roll off P1. Let's see if we could put something okay together. I might just let Ryan Newman get by me, though. He does have that inside of you. What? There we go. I'll let him go. Let him go. Let Rocket Man go. There's Jeff Gordon, too. Still there. All right. See if we can stay up around the front. I don't mind a win. We might luck into one as we hit Christopher Fittipaldi and Dale Jarrett. Sorry, guys. Good Lord. I'm sorry. There we go. Come on. Get through it. More yes. contact with Fittipaldi and with Dale Jarrett. I'm trying not to. He's hitting me now. Only the first life. Get the fuck away from me, dude. Don't be doing that to me. Alright, that's fine. Fittipaldi up front is such a rarity, I swear, man. Like what the hell is this? There. What's that Next 43 of Fittipaldi so doing easy. up front like that? This is so weird to be for me to see. No, no, no. And we just messed it up. 100%, we hit the wall. Great. Oh, no, we are making rivals back. This is not good. Need to get away from you guys as soon as possible. Ten laps to go, you heard from the spotter, or the crew chief, whoever he is. We don't want him Come on. Jared hits on. us. What else is new? I know it is. You're clear. Oh my god, no, no, too much, too much! Or too little breaking, no! Oh no, Mikey, I'm sorry! I'm just trying to keep the car on the track. Didn't break it enough. Great. Contact with 15 cars. Try to keep him behind you. Oh shit. No 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 no. Oh to keep the fuck. We're going, going off the course. We are going off the course. Fuck! Can I stop hitting people for once, please? Hello, Tony. Good corner. And already we got some cars that 
heading down pit road. Number 15. Huh. Trying to block you. Interesting. Car is yeah. looking right. Good corner. I'll take that. Watch it. There's Ryan. Oh, that's not right. It's Kevin Harvick. Why did I say Ryan Newman? What the fuck is I about to say? You're clear. Good. Probably gonna get by me here on the hillside. No, he's not. He's gonna break a whole lot more. Accelerate! Down, no! Right. Okay, maybe I'm breaking too much in that turn, but All clear, buddy. trying to make sure we stay on the track. We don't damage this car up anymore. Like so! Oh boy, that's gonna be fun to fix. Okay, we lost a spot. Number six, made some contact. Come on! Got to got gotta keep it off the track. Come on! Come on! Come on! Why are the tracks that I get on the pole also the most frustrating to run during a race? Like, real talk, why are they also the most frustrating? Oh, God, I'm just gonna, you know what? I'm not pitting. And we lead the race! Come on! Let's go. Can we hold on to it for once, though? Let's okay, see. Five more laps. Your left front tire's a little warm. You're just a little bit Long late on that exploration, man. Focused. I tell you what, maybe it's a little bit late on that, man. Oh! Oh! Hold on to it! Yes! Come on. Let's go! Good. Oh, the flag came out! What does that mean? Wait. Is this gonna be for the win? Oh shit, come on. Oh shit, come on. Come on. Come on! I wanted that because they it normally they were more like what three, four laps under caution? Could this race finish under caution? We gotta have a we gotta execute a great hairpin turn right here. There's to be Johnson. Oh no! Oh no! Didn't break enough! No! No! Oh! No! No! I think that's the race right there. Oh no! Oh! Please don't tell me that's the race. Please don't tell me that's the race. I'm not gonna pit. Oh wait! I got one more lap. Okay, one more lap. What the fuck? One more lap! This could be our first career top five. If we can get it across the line. Fuck, that's not good. See, that turn fucked me. Ah, oh, man. I tell you what, man. It's those damn... No, those turns in particular. You have to practice for next time. Yeah, fuck off, Tony. I'm gonna get this top five. I'm getting this top five! Too much, too much, too much. It's okay. Three wide here at Sonoma. That does not sound good at all. Come on. Let's be clean to the S's. Yes, good. Okay, so after we bring out the caution. <laughs> Whew. Come on, finish it! Biffle's right there! Oh, contact! Robbie Corn gets into Jeff Burton. We're gonna get right by the 31! No! Hold on to it, please! Hold on to it! Top three, baby! Let's go, Kerry! Let's go! Let's go! First top five for Kerry Earnhardt! Craven won! Craven got it! Man, what a race! Caution comes out and we get off track and we stay out and we manage to finish third. So there we go, man. How about it, man? Finish third, led three laps, we get 170 points. Uh, Craven won on the last lap pass. Shout out Ricky Craven, he gets the first win for Pontiac this season. Jimmy Johnson finished second with the most laps, followed by Robbie Gordon in fourth. Again, you can never count out Robbie Gordon at those road courses. Uh, Tony Stewart finished fifth, Jeff Byrne sixth. How about Greg Biffle getting his first top 10 in 7th? 8th is Johnny Benson. 9th, Sterling Marlin. And 10th was the 23 of Kenny Wallace. So, Jeff Gordon, sorry, not Jeff Gordon. Uh, Tony Stewart will continue his points lead. So, there you go there.
Uh, junior finished probably way back. This is not one of his better tracks. Uh, 28th, so. There you go. How about it, though, boys? We get a lot of money. We can now afford a race, up, a race shop upgrade. So let's go, man. Let's work on this car, though. We might have had a lot of damage. Yeah, I can see it. Let's overhaul this stuff, though, man. Yes, please. I can, I can afford to overhaul stuff now. I'll repair this engine, though, because I want to... I would like to afford a race up shop upgrade. This... This body needs some repair, man. It's the same body we raced at, um, at Michigan. And I ran it again because we don't have any other better bodies. So we, I'm going to have to repair it now. Uh, so we're going to go back to some, eh, equipment. But hey, one thing, we can get a shop edition. And right now, I would like to get, it could be cheap to get. You know what? I'm gonna go for the engine shop. So in nine races, we shall have an engine shop. We spent a lot of our money again, but hey. Craftsman's happy with us again. We fulfilled a lot of the bonuses. And if we can have a great race here in the Pepsi 400 at Daytona, I say good things can happen. So let's get into it. For the second time in a row, we're gonna have two races in one video. We finished third at Sonoma. What can we do at Daytona? All right, qualifying time at Daytona. Our first lap's probably gonna suck. Our second lap will probably put us from the top 30. Close to 25th at least, you know? That is the goal though. Dale Jr. is already on the pole. I don't think we'll be able to make much of a challenge for first. But uh, we'll definitely be able to put a good lap down. I'm, I'm fairly certain of that. Kerry Earnhardt did get a pull once here. The truck series, but uh, it's not going to happen right now with this kind of equipment. Alright, get off that turn. Not bad. Alright, where are we going to, where are we at? Where are we at? Probably 43rd, honestly. Probably 43rd. Yep. So right now it's 43rd. But I would love to make it a lot better than that. Good. Not a bad corner at all. A little bit sore for my taste. I think I'm moving just a little bit too much. There in those turns. There we go. Not bad, not bad. Finished 14th at the last Super Speedway race. So let's see if we can at least put something solid together. Gonna come across the line of our second qualifying lap. We've got a lot of ground to make and up. We'll qualify the in 28. Not the best, but not the worst. Well. We got some movement to do. Let's see if we can draft with Junior any of the DEI guys. The Pepsi 400 here at Daytona. Tonight, it's Super Speedway action under the lights. MRN is live at the Daytona International Speedway this evening with flag-to-flag -flag coverage of the Pepsi 400. To win a race is something pretty special at any track. But to win here at Daytona, you're that much closer to becoming a legend in the sport. There's no doubt about it. A lot of these NASCAR and Winston Cup drivers will tell you that it's really no different winning here than anywhere else. But those are the guys who haven't done it yet. Once their name is in the history books here, I guarantee you they'll change their mind. Dale Earnhardt Jr. will begin the race in the top five in points. Being in the top five is a huge boost in self-confidence. I know everyone on that team is very happy with their performance this season, and rightfully so. The 83 car is beating and banging on just about everyone, but lately he's really headed in for the 43 car. NASCAR has been known to park guys who can't behave themselves on and off the track. I don't think we have that type of situation here, but everyone would be better off by just getting back to racing. Jack Sprague will start this race a little farther back than he's used to. You're right, it's gonna be tough for him. You get so used to starting up front and then you have an off week and you have to start towards the back. Then when race day comes, you feel like you passed a thousand cars at the end. And worse yet, sometimes you never make it to the front.
the command has been given. We're going to roll off 28th position. Dale Jr. up front on the pole. Michael Walsh also in the top five. The points leader, Tony Stewart, is on the outside pole. Green flag in the air as we are ready to go here at Daytona. The Pepsi 400. Let's hope for something really, really darn good, man. Coming off that third place finish at Sonoma. Gonna move to Beth Steve Park, see if that'll be good. Oh, Kenseth, I see Matt. Get in front of Matt. What's up, Steve? What's up, Steve Park? Come on. I'm pushing you. I'm pushing you. Good. Getting some really good speed with Steve Park. Oh, he's checking up a little bit. I don't know what he's doing. Come on, stay in front of me. Stay in front of me, Steve. Yes, sir. There we go. We're moving up. Let's go. Working with Steve Park. Moving on up through the field. Kevin LePage might cut down in front of us. Maybe not. Oh, he will. With Kevin now, I guess. At 57-4 to Kevin LePage in that uh, CLR sponsored right. car. Three and a half seconds behind the leader. Let's cut that lead down. What's up? There's a Kenny Schrader behind me. In the BAM Racing 49. Come on. 24th now. They're starting to pull away from us. Not what I wanted. Help me out, Kenny. Kenny, help me. Thank you. Good. Just want to get back up to with uh, Kyle. Well, Kevin LePay. Well, I said Kyle. I'm thinking of Kyle Bush for some reason. Probably because I believe he drove the 57 in the Bush series for Hendrick. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of him. Ooh, nice lap. 49-338. Nice lap. Just try and stay in front of these guys, trying to get the draft from uh, Matt Kenseth, who has that Roush equipment. I'd love to work with him. Come on, push me up. Come on. Matt, come on. Come on now. Let's go. Let's go. Push me, damn it. Yes. Yes. Come on. He's coming up high. I'm going to probably block him. There's the 19. Oh, we just barely got in front of the 19. That could have been a risky right there. We're okay, though. We are just fine. Three wide behind me briefly. Seven seconds back. Don't worry. I'm going to take two tires on this pit stop. And that should help us out a lot in getting some, making up some extra time on the track. Come on, come on, come on, oh. Uh, get in front of Matt again. At least we're making good moves trying to stay in front of these guys. Up in our, again, our sponsorship requirement of 25th or better. Cars are already pitting. We're gonna move up a couple of spots due to some cars deciding to pit. We didn't have a caution during the Daytona 500. We stayed green throughout the race, so let's see what'll happen uh, in this one. We moved to 13th, not bad, not bad. I see Johnny Benson in that number 10 Valvoline Pontiac right behind me. Oh, Johnny Benson. I'm gonna stay out this, I'm gonna, let me see, what's our fill again? Right, I think I can do at least one more lap. Maybe pit this time around. I don't know. Let's, let's see what I can do. I might try and stay out. Get an extra drop ahead of everybody else. Number 10 is inside. Okay. All right. right. We're going to stay out. And I will be sec third coming across the line. We take the lead. All right, this is actually pretty good. <laughs> this actually is pretty good. What I'm thinking here, guys, is I know that uh, you know, less races than the race at Daytona, uh, 500, I should say. What I'm gonna do is, then I'm gonna short pit later in the race just to get me some extra, um, just some extra stuff going. 
give me some for short pick, give me sure I have some fuel to make it to the end, and and everybody else pits, I'll be fine. I don't know how to feel here, but that's fine. Cause I'm just gonna drift my way into pit road. Just break a good bit here, get us under to 70, and look at that. Perfect. Right, just do rights. Rights and full rights and rights in a full thing of gas. Rights in a full thing of gas. Oh, there's a little lap there, so let's go. Carrie right, Earnhardt's right, starting to lead some more laps. Only ten laps left. All right, good pit stop here, boys. All right, two tires only. And we'll get back out there. We'll lose the lead there, as you see. Probably gonna fall back quite a bit, but hey. Oh, no, 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 I'm not gonna page a field. No, no, no. <laughs> Almost the paged fucking Sterling Marlin there. Oh, God. That could have been bad. It's okay. So we come out 11th. See what I mean? See what I mean, boys? You just gotta make sure. Get those two tire stops. You can you know, get ahead of everybody else a little bit. And next time, we'll probably not even take lefts. Our lefts look fine. We'll probably not even take left sides. We'll just do fuel only, and then we'll just ga gas it out of there. So I think we could make it. There's Jeff Burton. I see Ward Burton, his brother, starting to make some moves, too. 99 puts a block on him, though. We are, we are 10 seconds behind the leader, who is uh, Jarrett. All right, good job. Good job, Kerry. I'm going to let Jeff Burton get by me, though. I want to save some fuel, and I can utilize that draft, though. Ward will come up right next to me. That's good. Hey, Ward. Hey, Ward. Hey, Ward. What's up, Ward? Jeff Burton's still underneath me. We're going to pass him again. Oh, my Lord. Let's go. Oh, here comes Jimmy. There we go. Ooh, hello, Ward. All right, there we go. See? Got right in front of Ward Burton. Right, right behind Ward Burton. And now I get to draft with him. Halfway there, boys. All right, let's just stick with Ward. I'm going to save some fuel by drafting with him. Come on now. Don't let Jeff get ahead of me. Don't want Ward to start driving away from me. Just stay alongside that 22 car. The leaders, are coming in the leaders are pitting right here. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay. Let's just stay drafted with Ward. The 99 is coming high. though on the high side. I see Bobby Labonte. We're halfway on fuel already, so gonna try to not get as much fuel or left side tires aren't that bad so I might not even take tires on this next stop Just trying to put myself ahead of everybody else Ward and I will go high no one gonna turn one and two but Bonsi's gonna be there I'm gonna nope. Focus on your mark, Whew, good save I didn't see Jerry do to Jerry do today I did not see Jerry do to us too late get your words right Maddie all right, gonna get right in front of Bobby Labonte. He's gonna break a little bit. Is he gonna pit this time? Oh, oh. You're clear. We're all clear. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Spotter. Thank you. We're off the pace. Everything okay? So they're gonna come in and pit. Nadu will lead him off down to pit road, and we fall back behind our old friend Rusty Wallace, who's still a bit of an ally from the uh, Talladega race. Let's just keep drafting with him. Leader, who's the leader? It's Junior, he's pretty, pretty darn far ahead. I tell you, he's pretty darn far ahead. It's not bad at all. Getting, getting a little fuel. bit low on fuel. I'm gonna probably bring it in this time. Couple top five cars are on their way into the pits. Cars entering the track ahead. Be careful. The left rear's getting Actually, no. I'll do an extra lap. No, wait, no, I'm not going to make it on extra lap. I'm not going to make an extra lap, actually. 
Let's hit this time. But again, we are just doing a stop. For gas. 10 second stop, boys. This is the gamble we are going to take to see if we can get ourselves at least maybe another top five or even the win. If we can make this gamble work, this will be huge. Junior's going to get out ahead of us quicker, though. He, came, he, was, he was ahead a good bit. So come on, come on, come on. Get it out, 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 get it out. All right. We are out in six. That might change, though. All right, eighth now. Okay. Eighth is pretty darn good. I'll, I'll give it that. Eighth is pretty darn good. Hello, Sterling Marlin. How you doing, buddy? You want to be drafting buddies for a bit? I most certainly can do that. I most certainly will be your drafting buddy. There we go. Here's pretty darn far ahead. Who's the leader? Oh, it's Stewart. Oh, no, not Tony. <laughs> no, not Tony. Man, Junior has not gotten a win yet at all this season. Remains second in the points based on how consistent he's been. We're going to pass Jack Sprague down low. It's amazing to me how Junior has finished well, just cannot get into victory lane. But right now, Tony Stewart leads. We are in eighth place, being helped out by the 40 of Sterling Marlin. Two straight finishes in the top 10. We can make it happen. No, 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 no. No, no, no. I'm not going to let you get by me. No, sir. Got to hug that bottom at this track. Come on. Come on now. Whew. The 42, though, starting to catch up to us. We're about eight seconds behind uh, Newman and everybody else in the top 10. Come on now, I know we've got something good going here. Three more laps around Daytona. We definitely put together another good finish. I hope you guys don't mind the two videos uh, in a row, the two races rather in a row, I should say. Just sometimes it's just, you know, the races get cut short due to cautions and uh, I think it's only the best thing is to just uh, put two in one, you know? At least that's how I see it, so. Halfway on fuel, we should be able to make it. I think we'll be okay. Sterling, just stay behind me, man. Two more times around. Two more times around Daytona. You heard the word there. We're starting to, we're catching up a little bit. I think we're only nine seconds behind now. We were eight, now we're nine seconds back. Yeah, Manny, do you get, get Manny, do your math right. Number forty is going on. I wasn't the best in math in high school, so that one's on me. That one's on me, boys. All right. Leader will come in and take the white flag. Our tires are worn to hell. I hope none of them blow. All right, I hope. I hope none of them blow as we will come around for the white flag. One more time around Daytona. We're going to win here someday. I, I have a feeling we're going to win here someday. Just got to get that right setup, that right qualifying time, better equipment, and I think uh, whew, we'll have a really a race and much better at these tracks. But an eighth place finish here will be good. It'll be very good. Just keep it ahead of Sterling. Here we go. No, 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 Sterling. Don't you dare get by me. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Checkered flag in the air. We'll see who won the race. And oh, hit the wall. No, no, no. Fuck. It's okay. We're fine. We're going to finish eighth, our third top ten of the season. 
here at Daytona. Let's go, boys. Good job, Carrie. Your winner is Michael Waltrip. Stewart second, Junior third, Harvard fourth. Wow, what a race. Woo. How about it, man? Two surprise winners. Ricky Craven won at, uh, won at uh, Sonoma. And now Michael Waltrip, who won two races in real life in this season, 2003. He wins the Pepsi 400 for the second straight year. He did win it in 2002. Let's go. More money, baby. Let's go. Even more money. I love to see it. Let's look at your uh, rest of your field. Uh, Martin fifth. Uh, Newman finished sixth. How about Joe Nemechek, who's had it rough this season, this game? He comes home seventh. We finished eighth, of course, leading one lap, so that's great. Sterling Marlin was right behind us in ninth place. Tenth was the ten of Johnny Benson. Eleventh was Matt Kenseth. Twelfth, Bob Dobby Labonte. Thirteenth, Jimmy Johnson. Fourteenth, Ricky Rudd. Fifteenth, Jeff Burton. Jerry Nadeau is 16th, there's Ward Burton, Jeremy Mayfield, Hermie Sadler, Steve Park, Ricky Craven, Rusty Wallace, Ken Schrader, LePage, Green, Sadler, Bush, Biffle, Gordon, Labonte, Gordon, wow, Jeff Gordon. What's going on with you, buddy? Uh, Kenny Wallace, Chase Montgomery, Kyle Petty, Ashton Lewis, Mike Skinner, Christopher Fittipaldi, Dale Jarrett, Bill Elliott, Brett Bodine, and Danny McMurray. Looks like Danny McMurray either... Had some trouble or got lapped, it looks like. Casey Mears retired early after seven laps, so big for us, actually, because McMurray is pretty far ahead of us in points and rookie of the year, so that's actually really good for us. But hey, we come home P8, our second straight top 10. Let's go, man. I mean, things are looking up. All right, so that will do things for this video. How about the how about our life cost two races, boys? Kerry Earnhardt, third, his first top five at Sonoma. Then we finished eighth at Daytona. I still want to, I need a draft with Junior sometime. I, I want to do it. Mark Oliveris suggested it to me for our Talladega video. I just could never get up to Junior. So I'd want to do that sometime. We got Chicagoland next, a track I don't think I'll do too bad at. New England, the 300 at New Hampshire, I think I'll do solid. It's, again, a heavy-breaking track, so I could definitely put on a good lap. Fucking Pocono! Oh, uh, the Brickyard. Then we got the Glen, so I think I could put a good finish together, maybe at New Hampshire. Maybe at the Brickyard. I don't know about Watkins Glen. Actually, I, if soon as we finish third at so no, we could do something good at Watkins Glen. And we got Michigan again. I did it. Michigan at Michigan. Bristol. Mm -hmm. Southern 500 at Darlington. Richmond. Uh, New Hampshire. Dover. And then the EA Sports 500. So we could put something good together. Hopefully we'll have to do two races in one video for you guys. Anyways, I'm heading out. Uh, go to you. Go follow me on Twitter. I am at Manny Jones FM. And on Twitch, I do NCAA Football 14 teams. Manny Jones FM there as well. Till next time, I'm Eddie Jones. I'm out of here.